It's uh, Sunday again at Pensop, but uh, we're in a bit of a different location this week. Um, we're out in the Overflow car park, um, and I just wanted to get across to you, you know, what happens when you sort of leave an area and you don't cut it? This is regularly cut, normally, but because of lockdown, um, we haven't, just haven't had the time to cut it. And if you pan back, as the camera goes, back towards the, 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 the car park, you can see very little colour, just the grass there. There's a few bits of clover and uh, dandelions. But in the overflow car park, look at the diversity and the colour that you've got. You've got all the, the purple um, knapweed and the, bird, the yellow bird's foot trefoil, the, the, the white, this is the white achillea at the front here, and then you've got the clovers. Um, it's a bit windy today, but um, if you come out here on a still day, you'll see all the insects, the dragonflies, and there, there's a butterfly and the bees. You know, what I'm trying to get across is maybe you could, could leave a little area of your lawn at home and let this sort of happen to it. It doesn't require any maintenance. Once the flowers go over, you know, it will get cut. And then uh, next year, all these species will, will come back up again. And they're all seed at the end of this year. Um, so it's an amazing colour. And the, the wind today is just giving an amazing pattern on the grass. So if you haven't been back to Pensorp, uh, hopefully we'll see you back in the next couple of weeks. Uh, the millennium's looking cracking, as is all the gardens at Pensorp at the moment. There's plenty of colour and lots to see, so uh, look forward to seeing you back at Pensorp.